Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well. May the Lord Jesus Christ bless you and keep you safe. I want to clarify some of the messages that I've been receiving in dreams, but I want to emphasize a dream that I posted on October 20th, 2020, which I titled, This Will Be The Last One. Some of the messages are not clear until we put them together. It's like a puzzle. In order to understand the message, we need to put them together. I'm going to read the dream I posted on October 20th, 2020. I will explain the meaning of the dream again with examples of things that are happening now that relate to the dreams. Please listen. Last night, the Lord gave me a dream with a very important message. I don't think we have much time left. In this dream, I was in this room. I remember looking out through a window and I saw a full moon in the sky. The moon looked huge. It looked different. It was very bright and it had black stripes. The moon was moving very fast throughout the sky. It got to a stop and I kept looking at the moon for a while. Then I looked inside in the room where I was and I saw a container. It looked like it was on a table. This container had a turkey ham. I knew in the spirit that it was for Thanksgiving. And then I heard very clear these words. This is the last one. This is the last one. Meaning, this will be the last Thanksgiving for America. And it will not be a normal Thanksgiving. As I was looking at Turkey, huh? I pictured war, destruction coming to America. And that was the end of the dream. Keep in mind, I had this dream on October 20th, 2020. The year 2020 was the last year that Trump will serve president. Joe Biden, which is controlled by Satan, came to office in the year 2021. And for those that don't know, the Lord revealed many times that Barack Obama is Satan. When Barack Obama was in office, he couldn't do anything that would make him look bad. That's why he puts others to do the work for him. Satan has taken control over America and it will not stop until America is destroyed. On March 21st, 2022, the Lord gave me a dream where I saw Barack Obama sitting on a chair. He had a table in front of him. He was talking to a lady. Barack Obama looked mad, evil. I was able to see Satan through him. Then I heard Barack Obama say, I've been waiting all my life for this time. And I was given understanding that Satan's time has come. Again, this dream was given on March 21st, 2022. We can see how this government is contradicting the laws of God when it comes to the LGBT of abortions and forcing people to have the mandate. On December 24, 2018, the Lord gave me a dream. In this dream, I remember I was in the backyard of my house. I was looking up at the sky and then I saw a nuclear bomb in the air. It looked like it was going down in a slow motion. The color of the bomb was black and it was huge. In my spirit, I knew that Barack Obama was the one sending this nuclear bomb to America. I was able to see this bomb really close and it hit the ground. And as it hit the ground, the earth crumbled. Remember, Barack Obama is controlling America to Joe Biden. And I can see this government provoking war with Russia by helping Ukraine with its war. Barack Obama will bring destruction to America, but he will never show his face because he doesn't want to look bad. On June 1st, 2022, I received another dream. In this dream I saw the year 1023, and I was given understanding that the Lord will return in that year. I remember I was puzzled in my dream. I was thinking, how can that be? We're living in 2022. When I woke up, I did the math. I add those numbers, it gave me number six. If I remove the zero and I multiply them, it gives me six. Six years from the year 2022 is 2028. If Biden serves the terms, his last year will be in 2028. Satan is taking control not only of America, but the whole world. He's working behind curtains. 
He's controlling a lot of people. Be aware of those wolves dressed in cheap clothing. Heed the warnings. God has been warning us, listen and heed the warnings. Jesus Christ is coming back very soon. Are you ready? Soon there will be no more time. Repent and come to the Lord Jesus Christ before it's too late. May the Lord Jesus Christ bless you, give you understanding, and keep you safe.